Good morning to all. You join us for this 5-5 between Qatar and Denmark. I'm Adam Gilchrist, and joining me for what should be an exciting contest is Michael Atherton, Mel Jones, and the one and only Ali Mitchell. Always a pleasure to sit alongside you in the commentary box. Thanks, Alison. It's time now for the toss. Let's join the pitch side to see who'll be donning the pads first. In the modern game, most captains opt to bat first, but just every now and again you see a pitch like this where the bowlers can do plenty of damage. Bowling first could well be a good option. Holmes, to get us underway, nice to see some pace first up. This new ball should give some movement early and make the batter's life difficult. Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get a big score on the board. Holmes, straight through them. Batter was late on that one. As they head back to the pavilion, they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently. Not too much to speak of on the scoreboard. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Beautiful timing there off the front foot. It's racing away. The fielder out in the deep has some serious work to cut it off. A poor delivery, and you don't pass up chances like that. Crashed away for four. Tried something a bit different last delivery, and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. Misses everything. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Five runs added in that over. Qatar are five for one. First over gone, and a respectable start by the batters. A new bowler is coming into the attack. Great commitment. Oh my, my, that's just flown off the middle. Erz on the side of bowling slightly fuller and they've been put away. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Couldn't get it through the field. Massive outside edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on length is obviously the way to go. Was quick onto that in the infield. Yeah. 
Four runs added in the over. Qatar a nine for one. Another good over by the bowlers. Bowled to their field well and mixed their deliveries nicely. The right armour is coming on to bowl from the clubhouse end. Missed it. That was a chance. They go up here, but it might have pitched a bit short. I think we'll have to wait and see what the umpire says. The trudge back to the pavilion, a disappointing display in the end for someone with such skill. This goes down as a fail. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Winds up but misses. Looks like they went a bit too early on that shot. Thick edge. End of the, the end of a very tidy over. Batting doesn't seem to be that easy out there at the moment. Good pressure being exerted. The slow left armour is coming on to bowl from the scoreboard end. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Great shot, pulled straight to backward square leg though. Threaded it through brilliantly, all timing on that shot. Can't afford to go too full again. It does help to switch up your deliveries, just to keep them guessing. Caught, gone. Super catch. What a crucial breakthrough this is. Excellent bowling to get one of the key wickets cheaply. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should be on as the new batter strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Perfectly timed. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with a plum. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Big edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. 
Goes for it. It's high in the air. Fielder coming around, but it looks like it'll carry. Well, didn't time that at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. Things have been kept relatively quiet here. Another good over comes to an end. This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Finds the fielder with that shot. Great shot. Gets a hold of that and places it through square leg. That showed great skill. Lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Just open the face of the bat really well. That's through the infield. That'll be four more. The gap was left open for them and they were happy to oblige. Picked it early, got into position well and punched it to the boundary. I didn't feel there was too much wrong with that last delivery. They just need to keep the ball in the right areas and the rewards will come. No, no, no. Terrible shot. The whole team's gone up here. What's the umpire going to say? It's another wicket, the fourth now. Sometimes you've just got to accept that you couldn't do anything about a delivery. That's a long way to walk out there, just to turn around and walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first run behind them and then push on. And that's the end of the innings. All below par and the openers are going to be looking to close this out quickly. The bowlers are going to have to find something to make up for the rest of the batting team's failures. Here we go. Coming in for the first ball. Now, yeah, great opportunity to prove the critics wrong. Certainly needs to build an innings for the team. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Goes over the top with that shot.
Great shot. Pulled straight to backward square leg, though. Doesn't beat the infield. Over. Denmark are five for none. The left arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the clubhouse end. Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Edged it. Wow, that's a huge appeal for the catch. If there's something on it, it was the faintest of edges. Beautiful take, caught and bowled. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Well, that ball has been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward onto the front foot is just ridiculous. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. That is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, dispatches it to the boundary. Bonus runs here, four of them. The fielder probably thinking of keeping the batters honest, but it's only succeeded in frustrating the bowler. Thick edge. 13 runs added there. Denmark are 18 for one. With two down, they're already ahead of the required run rate quite easily early on. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the scoreboard end. Edged. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
Two straight and punched through the leg side, mid-wicket in hot pursuit. What a great shot that was. Onto the front foot really quickly. No stopping that one. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. Perfectly timed. Huge edge. Seven runs added there. Denmark, a 25 for one. Going with spin now. Finds the edge. Plex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Gorgeous cover drive, surely heading to the boundary. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. Thank you very much for joining us here for this match. That was a mighty win. Really, just too easy to score runs and chase down that total with time to spare. A great all-round performance.